Oh. <laughs> you have to call a show to yourself, don't you? I, I have to pull the attention. So as the best man, I finally get to make this speech. We're now at ten and a half years that we've known each other, Ducky. We've been best friends through it all, through thick and thin, every rocky road we've managed to crawl through. It's been six countries, six heartbreaks apiece, multiple hours of just spending time with each other. Yeah. Now it's time for a new chapter in your life, a new chapter in Noelle's life, for both of you to be together as husband and wife. I wish you two nothing but the best, and I want nothing but good fortune for you in your future. I'm Danny. I'm Noelle's matron of honor. Um, it seems just like yesterday we were, <laughs> we were running around playing tag or hide and seek in the truck garage while our parents were in the fire department meetings or attempting to dye our hair with a chalk <laughs> and <declare. laughs> I forgot about or that. most recently dislocating my jaw on a slip and slide. Oops. Thank you for that one. <laughs> we have spent many late nights in the barn preparing for horse shows and spent many days outside in the rain. I have watched you not only grow into an amazing equestrian, but amazing sister, friend, and now wife. It's hard to believe that we're old married ladies now. <laughs> For those of you that know me, I'm a very straightforward person. Not afraid to tell you how it is. Eric, when I first met you, I threatened you with a shovel. Thankfully, I never had to use it. You have always treated her with respect and unconditional love. You knowingly married this beautiful woman, knowing that I'm a package deal. Sorry, not sorry. I will still be stealing her away for Grover's Congress trips and wine nights. Noel and Eric, I have some advice for you. Never go to bed angry. Always kiss her goodbye. And don't question why there's a new horse in the field. <laughs> I wish you guys the absolute best. I love you both forever and always.